Matt, thank you very much for taking part in the uh, Global Sports Job 60 Second Interview Series. Please explain who you are and where you come from. My name's Matt Rogan. I'm Managing Director of Two Circles. Um, we're an organisation that uses data and the science behind data to help sporting organisations, whether it's clubs or federations, get close to their customers. Um, I come to this from a fairly broad career background. I started off working for a Bain McKinsey spin-out strategy consultancy that specialised in sports media and FMCG. Fell in love with uh, the sporting space and then worked at the NBA for four and a half years. Jumped from there to, to MTV while I ran the European Sponsorship Team for about the same amount of time. And, and over the last um, six years, six and a half years, was um, commercial director of Lane 4, an HR consultancy with uh, heritage in the Olympic space. So I guess I've got experience of, of both strategic consulting using data, um, working in commercial roles in sports and, and other rights holders, and finally running a professional service business. And so to all intents and purposes, my role at, at Two Circles encompasses all three. I guess my, my real advice I'd have in the, in the career space for those people looking to develop careers in the sports world would be just to understand that I think the world's changing. Um, so your competition for a role now actually isn't um, anybody else who's done a similar role in another place in sport. Your competition is people who've done similar roles in business. And so for that reason, I think there's a real continuing education responsibility for all in sport to make sure they're not just bringing the best of sport into themselves and what they learn, but also the best in what British blue chip business and global blue chip business is doing as well. Um, so I think it's a case of thinking creatively about sometimes you might need to step out of sport to come back in to get yourself some blue chip experience. Or you might just need to be curious about what's going on in the world. It's reading business publications as well as sports publications for one simple example. I think that's really the way we in our business can see the industry going, which is being a lot more focused on bringing the best of you know, insight from how retail manages customer relationships and CRM, you know, how it happens in the travel industry into the sports environment because I think in a lot of ways that's a lot more pertinent to what the Premier League than what the Premier League Club down the road or the or the Olympic Federation down the road is actually doing. So that's what the business has been set up to do. And I hope that's some help. Matt, you've been very kind. Thanks very much.